special Friday night under the lights at Rocky Mountain High School as the football team dedicates the evening to U.S. veterans in honor of Idaho's most recent fallen soldier. Six on your side's McKenna King is live from the football field and tells us all about Veteran Appreciation Night at Rocky. Don, it was a pretty memorable evening here at Rocky Mountain High School. American flags lined the football field and the team put on a pretty special production in honor of Army Special First Class Dustin Ard as well as all veterans here at the game tonight. I think it's important that the community knows that one of our own changed their blue star to gold and it's it's good for us to be here to support them. Idaho native and Army Special First Class Dustin Ard was killed in combat in Afghanistan in August. Ard attended the Meridian Medical Technical Charter School, not Rocky Mountain High, but that didn't stop the Rocky football team from rallying together to honor him. Somebody that we know and we can relate to and it's one of our own people that we know, I think it's important that our kids understand that you know, there's a lot going on in life and they need to take advantage of the opportunities that we give them. A quick turnaround. The team threw the entire event together in just three weeks in honor of Dustin and all veterans and their families. Blue Mothers is going to be here and they basically put together a lot of care packages for soldiers abroad and so we're going to recognize them. At the time, we ask you please rise and show your support and humble admiration. As well as the Gold Star families, those who have lost soldiers at war, including Idaho's most recent Gold Star family, the Ards. They've been fighting in Afghanistan for 18 years, and these football players on the field, they're, next year if they enlist in the military, they could be fighting in a war that started before they were even born. It's a spe really special for me because I'm going to go to uh, Air, the Air Force Academy in Colorado Springs. And Garrett isn't the only Grizzly preparing to serve his country. But I know a couple kids on the team that are going to the forces. A crew honored and proud Lord to wear the red, white, and blue. On the right, we've got the red, the stripes, and the red stripes, and then stars, the blue on the right. We wanted to connect the importance of doing something full speed, being part of something bigger than yourself, and honoring those that give us the right to play this game on a Friday night. The score was pretty memorable this evening as well. Rocky Mountain played Centennial High School and Rocky won 65 to 0. Live in Meridian, McKenna King, six on your side.